Rainbow High update! We just got our semester project and it is hashtag intense. Brutal. Full on runway show. Seven looks. Big set. Hair. Makeup. Music. And we do it in front of the whole school. And if we mess up, Miss Wrights, it will get cut. So much pressure, right? I meant to do that. SOS! I don't know how to fix this thing. I got this. This is sick, total next level. Our group is really lucky to have you, Amaya. I mean that. I do. Thanks. Two minutes till curtain. Fog lamp ahead! Our last runway group has had some big ups and big downs, but this is their moment to shine. Please welcome to the stage, Ruby, Poppy, Sunny, Jade, Skylar, Violet, and Amaya. Ready for this? No rain? No, no rainbow. rainbow! No rain, no rainbows. <gasps> There's a lot I want to create and accomplish as an artist. It can be really rough. But that's definitely what made me who I am. So I'm grateful. That's my rainbow. I think in music, but it means I can get super distracted. And it's not so great for my friendships. When I focus and connect with other people, I find my rainbow. My music has been better because of it. is illustrating my daydreams and turning them into whole new worlds. I hope my friends watch my work and feel like they can be open to, even when it's hard. My biggest goal when I give someone a makeover is to give them enough confidence to be themselves, even when they take the makeup off. I practice that on myself every day. My rainbow is learning to take credit for my designs and hear what people really think of my work. It's hard to put myself out there, but it's seriously making me a better designer and teammate every single day. I put a lot of my life online. It's a lot of pressure to be so on all the time. And it's definitely easy to lose track of real life. But my friends keep me grounded. They're my reality check and my rainbow. Sometimes I change my designs and myself so much I can lose track of the original seriously do anything to adjust things until people like them. So I'm always working on keeping myself grounded and remembering what I'm made of. The whole rainbow. No rain, no, no rainbow. rainbow. Wow, super surreal to be up here. <sighs> it's crazy to think that only a few years ago, I was sitting where you are as a first year. <laughs> but I've come a long way since then. Welcome to the art of fashion. I'm Jet Dawson, <gasps> AKA queen of the quick change. <laughs> this year, I've been traveling and studying all things fabric. Fabric creates art that doesn't just live statically in a museum. 
fashion. Fashion is meant to be seen by the world. And with every new outfit, we can make ourselves into living art, no matter what we're wearing. Totally wow, right? So cool. So, what do you say? Ready to make some fashion magic? I brought a bunch of different fabrics. Your mission is to layer the fabric to plus up this plain piece into utter couture. Quality materials. Make bold choices. All about craftsmanship. And how's it going here? Huh? Oops, didn't mean to mess with your flow. Oh, I didn't realize you were... Um, I'm done. Wow, that was fast. Can I take a look? Amaya's done already? I like your work with texture and color, but to be honest, it looks like you did it fast. Yeah, working crazy fast is kind of my thing. When I get inspired, I want to make sure I get all of my creativity out before it, uh, disappears. You know, one day, I got to shadow this amazing brocade artisan in China. And can you believe she only weaves a centimeter a day? Wow, that's... Slow. Let the quality of work match the quality of the fabric. Let the craftsmanship shine. Let the craftsmanship shine. I love what I'm seeing. Can I get a little sneak peek? Wow, look at all the layers. How much time did you spend ironing these? I really took my time with them. The pleats remind me of Chinese hand fans. Love it. Wow, Amaya, you really took my notes to heart. Tell me about it. I realized my stitching was rushed before. So I decided to take my time and make it stand out. I even used some special shimmer thread I splurged on at Muse Fabric Sample Sale. The gold accents make your craftsmanship literally shine. You know, it kind of reminds me of the Japanese art of kintsugi, where artists repair broken dishes by filling in the cracks with gold to make them stand out. Yes, that's what I was going for. I just think it's a beautiful way to pick something other people may have just thrown out. I love that. And this skirt. It's art. It's fashion. It's just so cool. Yeah, what she said. Hey, so no shocker here. I'm not your teacher. I'm Aiden Russell, fine arts teacher's assistant. And I love art of music because this is where music and art collide. Rockin'! Beyond rockin'. As you can see, I volunteered Poppy to demonstrate. Her turntable is hooked up to that screen and that box of magnetic filings. You play your music, we'll see your art. Legend! See, it's like you're painting and sculpting with sound. Let's kick it up! Good morning, and welcome to Dream Teamwork Project Day. Fourth years will lead a teams of first years in a number of ambitious projects on this year's docket. It is a true marathon of the arts, as you will only have 12 hours from start to finish. Your kickoff email with group assignment will be sent shortly. And remember, the time limit is strictly enforced. Tick tock. Dream teams, that deadline looms closer. Okay. 
Hey. Collaborating is good and all, but maybe. For looming deadline's sake, we split up into groups. Yes, divide and conquer. Gabriella, Sky, you go talk wardrobe with Vanessa, and the rest of us can scout locations, talk sets and such. Ah, and that's a lot of to use, so let's go do it fast. Oh. I love this Captain Sunny energy. Go! I want to make sure the fashions are all sustainable, so I brought in some vintage fabric I thrifted to make into a chill but totally immaculate wardrobe. Yes! Love that. Old fabric? But this has potential. <gasps> this print and the feel! Quality! Right? They don't make it like that anymore. And there's way more where that came from. And here we are at the halfway mark. Halfway? Are you kidding? We haven't nailed down anything! Fiery face emoji! We need actual decisions made! Stat! Whoops, that's my hangry voice. <laughs> but, come on, we gotta get a move on. Can someone get me a snack? <laughs> so, what do you suggest we do? First, we figure out what's doable. Vanessa, you want wardrobe changes. Gabriella and Skye, how many wardrobe changes can you handle in the next uh, two hours? Hmm, one change. One change if they go from what they're wearing right now to their next look. Great, done. After that, it's action fun time. Emmy, how do you feel about starting with the walkthrough using locations like what Lyric wants, but then you and I create something with extra powy wow zow for the stage portion? I think I can handle Powy Wow Zow. Perfect! Ha! You know it! Poppy and Daria, find the longest cables you can, plus an amp on wheels. On it! Now we have five hours left to make all your dream teamwork project music video dreamy dreams come true, and we're making them come true on time! Deal? Deal. Deal. Six hours until deadline, people! We all know how to tell time, Ash. Really? I just learned. Very embarrassing video of Chanel. <laughs> embarrassing but funny. <laughs> Natasha, why do you smell like fresh snow on a winter's day? Smart nose. That's half the smell component of my new scent. That's really impressive. Thanks. The other half of the smell is Essence of Lily. I'm just waiting for the mixture to cure. <gasps> no! I waited too long! Messy. And thought-provoking. Painfully in my face. I like this. Huh. I would wear this dress. Not if I wore it first. Good work, first years. Your teachers will be impressed. Historically, the outside of the crest represents the craft of every Rainbow High student. But at Rainbow High, there's always more than meets the eye. Everyone here makes beautiful and unique art that is seen on the outside. But to be chosen to represent the Rainbow High Crest, you must also embody glam virtues on the inside. There is a prize at the end of the Rainbow High Archives. But where are the archives? What is the prize? Here's your start. Find the map that every student has. I am pumped to learn from Harley Limestone. Her lyrics are so raw. I'm excited to hear the rest of your song in the semifinals tomorrow, Natasha. <laughs> Me too. Because I can't wait to sing my entire song. Welcome to my workshop. Right to rock. Now let's rock. <laughs> okay. We talked about how writing is about passion and made a list of things you're passionate about. Makeup, moisturizer, perfume. Especially my signature scent. Look, by Natasha. What about something like this? You wrote this just now? 
It's no big deal. I have like a million songs. But I want a song I at least helped, right? Okay, let's try something new. Word association. I'll say a word, you tell me the first word it makes you think of. Rockstar. Mmm, uh, double wings. Vegan. No parabens. Earthy. Ooh, look, look, look. Everybody wants a look, now I gotcha. Nothing gonna stop ya, look by Natasha. Ooh, see, I caught ya, that's what I thought ya. Look, look, look by Natasha. Hey, hey. Hoppy, write down the music. Daria, the lyrics. Delilah? Just do you. Rainbow High's cutting-edge creative celebration. The sky's the limit. As long as you stay on theme, projects must transport visitors into a fantastical realm of out-of-the-box, show-stopping, innovative creation. In short, you must wow me. And the special surprise guest judge... This only happens every three years, so... For most of you, this is your one and only chance to make Radiant Week history. Herstory. <laughs> your team's reflection of the theme is crucial to a successful Radiant Week project. So, without further ado, the theme selection ceremony. Your fierceness. And this year's Radiant Week theme is Perspective. Ooh, such rich inspiration! For Radiant Week, you can choose your team or choose to work alone. And with that, Radiant Week begins now! At an elite school like Rainbow High, it can feel like our decisions are under a microscope. Our project embraces that and shifts perspective to put every tiny detail on display. Oh, what's oh, what's what's Sometimes the things you see every day can inspire if you just look at them in a new way. Come and join us. <gasps> <gasps> that is so cool. Amazing. Interesting. I used similar technology for my interactive staging of Little Women just last year. For our Lux Spiderweb, we sourced a rare fabric from Indonesia. Delicate, but strong. Just like a spider silk. Sometimes, the pressures of school can make you feel like a fly trapped in a web. But shift your perspective. You can become the one spinning it. And the trap becomes... A tool! <clears throat> I, I do need help. I don't get it. They just made a normal room? What, it, what the? Welcome to our room. It may look three-dimensional, but it's entirely made up of custom art. Airbrushed in fine details to look hyper-realistic. Even that neon sign is painted. We decided to use forced perspective to make you question if you can trust your eyes or if truth itself is an illusion. Hmm. Inventor. But still what? I don't just hear music. I see it everywhere. We wanted to show what that's like from my perspective. So we made it possible to rock out using anything and everything. Come on! Grab something and make your own song! Miss Wright, would you like...
like to be our volunteer? Most mirrors just show your look from a single, flat perspective. Ours can show you, you, from all angles, so you know that your look will turn heads and open minds. 